VCon 2023 was an incredible experience. For me, it just felt like this cosmic and transformational event. And what started as a mission to meet Gary V, I did get to meet Gary V, <laughs> turned into a deeply personal experience that has energized me and inspired me to commit even harder to the path that I'm already on. I spent so much of the day wondering what I was gonna ask him. And I decided I was going to just share my life story and, and ask him for any little nuggets of wisdom that he could share with me, knowing my story. And the thing that gravitated me towards Gary V in the first place was working for my family business. And that's a huge part of his story as well. I spent seven years serving my family through our business and eventually took the leap and took my dream job at a marketing agency, but realized that wasn't for me either. And so recently I quit my job and I'm going full time into entrepreneurship and content creation. And in that journey, even though it's my heart's calling, I felt so much internal struggle. Even though in my heart, I know that I wasn't meant to be at that job and I have different gifts that I'm meant to offer the world. I also have a deep desire to be a provider and a protector to the future family that I wanna create with my partner. And so in the last few months, I've been incredibly hard on myself and the progress that I feel like I should be making. And in Gary's Eliminate Fear keynote, he said we judge ourselves while we're still in progress. We don't judge a three-month-year-old baby and, and tell them they're not good enough. We give them compassion and nurturing energy and patience, knowing that they have the potential to grow into so much more. Knowing that where they are right now is just a snapshot of who they could be. And when I heard that, I felt like he was speaking directly to me, reassuring me that I'm still so early on in this process. I'm still in progress and I still have time. <laughs> I still have time to develop and nurture myself into the person that I want to share with the world. And Eric Thomas, the number one motivational speaker in the world, had an amazing talk. And he said, you already are everything you need to be. I think we often wait for the validation from something external to believe in ourselves or to be confident in ourselves. We wait for the number in our bank account to look a certain way. We wait for the followers on our Instagram to be a certain amount. We wait for the recognition of others before we feel confident in who we are. But the people speaking at this event and the energy that I felt there reassured me that I am everything that I want to be already. Even if the world hasn't recognized that or found me yet, I am. <laughs> I already am everything that I aspire to be. And I'm just waiting for the world to, to catch up and find me. And the final thing that I took from VCon 2023 was that success isn't as important as we make it out to be, at least not material success. During Gary's Eliminate Fear keynote, someone had asked a question and expressed that they were afraid to fail in front of their children. And so Gary took to the audience and asked us, how many of us love our parents because they built a wildly successful business? The crowd was completely silent. And then he asked us how many of us love our parents because they are kind and compassionate and loving people. And the crowd made so much noise. And again, in that moment, I felt like he was speaking directly to me, answering that question that I never got to ask him. Recently in my journey, I've been so caught up in the financial side of being a provider and being a man of service in my community. And just the audience reaffirming that my value as a father or provider or protector isn't measured by the number in my bank account. It's just measured in the love that I can provide and give and share with my family and my community that the pursuit of my dreams doesn't have to end in this outcome that makes me a millionaire so that I can provide them with whatever material things that they need. And what they really need is love, support, and a nurturing father. So Gary, even though I didn't get to ask you my question face to face, I wanna thank you for just giving me a hug and signing my book and, and for answering our community's questions in your keynote and in whatever act of God or serendipity, I felt like you answered my question anyway. And along with this incredible event with so many gems for entrepreneurship and marketing and Web3, 
there were so many powerful lessons I took even spiritually and emotionally and personally from this event. So if you have the chance to go to VCon at any time, I would highly recommend it, not only for your business, but for your soul, <laughs> for your personal journey. And I had so many ideas of what type of content I would make about VCon, what would get the most clicks. But I'm glad I decided on this because this is the video I wanted to make. Just a reflection of all the things that I learned, everything that I took away from it, so I can look back on it whenever I might be questioning my path, when I might be having those mental battles with myself. And so if you're a V friend, if you're a part of the community, please reach out. I would love to get to know you and talk to you. And even if you're not, even if you're just a part of my community and you want to reach out and you got anything from this video, man, I just want to spread love, share love, and share my process with all of you. And if you watch this far, man, I appreciate you. I wish you all the best and God bless.